Synthetic tissue can repair hearts, muscle, and vocal cord. This is by McGill University. Combining knowledge of chemistry, physics, biology, and engineering. Scientists from McGill University, which is in Montreal, Canada, develop a biomaterial tough enough to repair the heart, muscles, and vocal cords, representing a major advance in regenerative medicine. People recovering from heart damage often face a long and tricky journey. Healing is challenging because of the constant movement tissues must withstand as the heart beats. The same is true for vocal cords. Until now, there was no injectable material strong enough for the job. This is what Wang Giu Bao, PhD candidate, Department of Mechanical Engineering at McGill University says. The team led by Professor Luke Mongo and Assistant Professor Jian Yu Li developed a new injectable hydrogel for wound repair. The hydrogel is a type of biomaterial that provides room for cells to live and grow. Once injected into the body, the biomaterial forms a stable, porous structure allowing living cell, live cells to grow or pass through to repair the injured organs. Guan Yu Bao says the results are promising and we hope that one day the new hydrogel would be used as an implant to restore the voice of people with damaged vocal cords, for example, example laryngeal cancer survivors. And putting it to the test, the scientists tested the durability of their hydrogel in a machine that developed to simulate the extreme biomechanics of human vocal cords. I finally support my Patreon accounts. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support, and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box. The biomechanics of human vocal cords vibrating at 120 times a second for over 6 million cycles. The new biomaterial remained intact while other standard hydrogels fractured into pieces, unable to deal with the stress of the load. Guan Ju Bao says, we were incredibly excited to see it work, take work perfectly in our test. Before our work, no injectable hydrogels possessed both high porosity and toughness at the same time. To solve this issue, we introduced a pore forming polymer to our formula. The innovation also opens new avenues for other applications like drug delivery, tissue engineering, and the creation of model tissues for drug screening, the scientist says. The team is even looking to use the hydrogel technology to create lungs to test COVID-19 drugs. They said our work highlights the synergy of material science, mechanical engineering, and bioengineering in creating novel biomaterials with unprecedented performance we're looking forward to translating them into the clinic, said Professor Jianju Li, who holds a Canadian research set chair at Biomaterials and Musculoskeletal Health. This is by McGill University on Science Daily. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support.